Hello and welcome, my name is Kyle Falloon and welcome back to another episode of Race to Prestige here on Black Ops 1. This is episode number 21 and in the last episode we got ourselves to level 38 which is very very exciting because we have unlocked the beautiful AK-47 which is my favorite weapon in this entire game. I absolutely love it and today we're going to be using it in every single game of the video without fail because it is absolutely awesome and really I'm looking forward to using this thing weapon again. Again, just happy Halloween to you guys. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed the Halloween special. I'm not sure if it's going to get very many views, but I did enjoy making that video and it's sort of a tradition at this point here on the channel because there are so many of you guys who are new, probably didn't expect to see that video today, but yeah, it's been a tradition I've been doing for three years. It's a lot of fun to do. And again, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. But anyways, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and jump into the three games of video and I'll see you guys there. All right guys, welcome into game number one. We are playing some TDM here on the map. Nuketown, hopefully we can do well. Okay. Let's go ahead and push out. Oh my gosh, what are you doing there, buddy? What are you doing? There we go, there's another guy down. And another guy down, beautiful. Also, I should make it clear that I woke up like... half an hour ago so I'm not really like super awake yet luckily this is a Call of Duty game that you can actually play not like super super awake but since there's no skill based matchmaking but still yeah if, if things look a little rusty for this first game or two it's because I just woke up okay get out of here those stuns are absolutely brutal luckily I can get away from I was able to get away from that nade in time. Okay, do I push into this building? I'm going to. Look at it, man. It's beautiful. Damn. Well, I think I'm going to include three extra games since we did join a little bit late. And we also happen to do pretty bad in this game. So uh, I will see you guys in the real full game number one. All right, guys, welcome into game number two. Or game number one of the video. Jeez, we are playing some TDM on launch this time. Hopefully we can do well. Rocking out here with the AK-47. Now, for whatever reason, enemies are spawning right in front of me. Or, or teammates are spawning right in front of me, which is... A bit strange. But yeah, this weapon is just my favorite. Of course, it's not going to be good from that range. And it also doesn't help when you miss very, very important shots. Focus, Kyle. Focus, dude. Hmm. And you're crazy, dude. You're crazy, Mr. Level 8. Like, some people genuinely have, like, four or five KDs in this game. Honestly, the last three, R three ARs that you unlock in Black Ops 1 may be the best three ARs in all of Call of Duty history. I mean, think about it. The AK-47, the Commando, and then the G-11. May well, may maybe I'm... No, that's, that's correct. That's right. Yeah, so... Genuinely. Like, these final ARs may be the best... Like, the best three in Call of Duty history. Oh my god, dude. What is going on? I need to focus. I need to stop, like, talking. And, like, having a conversation here. Because this is clearly not... That clearly is not going well for me here. There we go. There's two guys down. Please do not die. 
Think my teammate bailed me out there. Thank you very much. Come get this in. This should show me. Some of these enemies. No! It is scary. But it is so nice to have this AK back. I will, of course, continue to mix up my weapons in this video, or in this series, but... I will also be using the AK a lot. Because it is a beautiful weapon that I absolutely love. Unfortunately, we went on a nice streak at the very end of this game. My teammate got a second chopper gunner. Jeez. Should party up with this guy. Okay, I'm not even going to get my dogs because my teammates are so good. <laughs> well, there we go, guys. 20 and 7. Unfortunately, we died a little too much at the beginning of the game there and kind of throughout, which is kind of unfortunate because this could have been a really, really good game. I mean, my teammate went 28 and 1. He's probably going to be on the other team next game, though, unfortunately, because even though this game doesn't have skill based matchmaking, it does have lobby balancing. So we'll see what happens. But, anyways, I'm not going to be upset about that score. That's, that's above our normal KD, so I'll take it. Um, I will see you guys in game number two. All right, guys, welcome into game number three. We are playing some TDM here on Array. Hopefully we can do well. Rocking out here with the AK-47 once again. Now I have decided that I'm going to include an extra game for you guys just because I feel like the games at the beginning of this video were not very good. So I kind of want to make it up to you a little bit. He's going up the stairs. Come on. No, I got shot in the back. Dang it. Is there a guy in here? Friendly spy plane inbound. Beautiful. Dude, are you kidding me right now? Shoot. Cobra on the way. Okay, let me quickly get this in. So we can just see if there's any guys hanging out around here. Which there is not. At the moment. Enemy there is somebody maybe over here this way, possibly. Hmm. I need to watch out. Perfect. That actually wasn't even the guy I was aiming at. Your equipment is gone. Toss and sticky. Kill confirmed. Okay, let's be careful, man. Play smart here. I spy planes in the air. Enemy spy it's gonna be, that's going to be a huge help for all of us. Especially when I was on a good streak, too. That is such a bummer. Spy planes in the air. Been going that way. But you know what? I am playing a bonus game for you, as promised. So maybe we can actually get one good game. I mean, we've had 
I think every game in this video has been around a 2KD, I think. We did get one set of dogs, but unfortunately the freaking guy enemy team rage quit. Which kind of took a damper out of that, but... Or the host rage quit, which means the lobby disconnected. So... Yeah, you know, I definitely thought that we were going to get all of our streaks today. At least in the majority of the games, but it just didn't, just, fortunately didn't work out that way, but it's okay. I apologize, guys. I'll see you in the final game of the video. All right, guys, welcome into the final game of the video. Rocking out here with the AK-47. Again, as I promised, with a little bit of a change attachment. Rocking out here with the red dot sight, which is a little bit unorthodox for me with this weapon, but it seems like all day I've been losing enemies in the iron sights. So maybe that's the solution here. Enemies using ghost and camping with ghost. Okay. No idea where I am, but I'm oh, let's go double kill. I right, actually pull out hardened. Keep the silencer and rock out with the silencer and the red dot. That's an option. One I might, might honestly not be opposed to. Okay, let's be smart here. Because I'm sure that there's probably some enemies... Spawning over here. Since, th since this is kind of... Where a lot of in it, a lot of these guys are hanging out. Sorry, teammate. Enemy spy plane incoming. You have no nameplate above you? I'm gonna... I'm gonna get you. Where's that spy plane at? Man, I'm honestly glad that people don't pay attention to the minimap. The amount of times it saved me is insane. Oh, hey, buddy. See you later. I don't even know who threw that. Okay, let's go over here. I mean, I've been thinking about this game, and I think I honestly might be, might use the Strella for like this entire series from here on out. Just because, in all honesty, in all honesty, the secondaries in this game are so bad. And I've barely used them at all, especially with Scavenger Pro. But there's just no need, man. There's, it's, it's much better for me to destroy spy planes than to suffer, you know, with them having a constant radar up. You know what I mean? This is definitely something I'm thinking about here. Huge. Yep. 
No, you do not kill me. Teammates aren't pulling their weight, so not really a ton I can do here but about that, but we're doing fine, man. No negativity here, especially because we're 15 and 3 now. My chopper gunner hasn't killed anything yet. That guy's underground. Everybody's using ghost. Besides three people. Yeah, too bad this isn't a very good map for a chopper gunner. Yeah. Damn it, they're all camping in that building. And I can't hit them for some reason. There we go. Well, at least we got five kills with it. I guess that's better than nothing, right? Yeah, that's better than nothing. I don't know, though. I'm definitely determined to continue to try out the silencer with this thing. It's a it's a good attachment. Sit down. But if I can if the red dot sight ends up making this weapon better and giving me better KDs using it, then I will continue to use the red dot sight and only the red dot sight. Things happen. Get owned. This man double stunned me and I still outgunned him. Amazing. Okay. Thank you very much. We're still losing this game somehow. Where did this guy go? Okay, luckily I can... Can do this without getting shot in the back. Saved by the bell. But look! Four and a half KD and we lost! Well, I can tell you this. I like the AK with the red dot a lot better. Um, tomorrow... In tomorrow's episode, I definitely will try out this weapon with the with Hardened, or whatever the perk is. I think it's Scout, actually. Um, yeah. I think... Oops, I apologize for that. Um, I think it is Scout, or whatever perk allows me to get, get more attachments. I'm definitely going to try that out tomorrow. Um, let me see if I can actually find it real quick here. Um, Warlord? Yeah. Yeah, Warlord. I'll, I'll try that out. You know what? Let's go ahead and do that now. I s and then we'll go ahead and equip the silencer. I mean, of course, it means I can't reload fast, which I may not like very much. It also means I can't aim down sight fast. But what I will do is I'll test it in a private match. But I'm also going to make this official as well. Secondary launchers Estrella. Just because it's it's... Unfortunately, when it comes to this game, if you do not use um, a launcher or a ghost, you're always on the radar, which might be why, why we haven't been doing the best. Um, but anyways, I'm almost embarrassed to show you this because it's been such a um, not good episode, but our win loss has gone down by a ton, and our KD has gone down by a ton this episode too. I mean, as you guys can see there from the games that I've played in this video, Things have not really gone the best, but it is what it is. Again, things happen. And even more disappointing, my KD with the AK-47 is a 1.7, not even a 2. Bummer. Um, but anyway, guys, that's going to do it for this next episode. Hopefully, the next one will be a lot better. Um, I think it will be. You know, it just goes kind of a weird day. Again, hopefully, you guys all had a really, really good Halloween. Let me know if you um, did anything fun or anything like that down below in the comments. 
And if you guys did check out my Halloween special video, I really do appreciate it. But anyways, uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, all I can is always appreciate it. Check out any of the previous episodes of this series. They will all be linked down below in the playlist in the description. As well, they will also be at the end of the video for you guys to check out as well. I'll see you all on another Call of Duty video very, very soon. <laughs>